Music legend Beyoncé has threatened Donald Trump's presidential campaign with legal action after the former U.S. president posted a clip of himself leaving a plane while using her iconic track Freedom without her permission. According to Rolling Stone, Beyoncé did not give her consent for the track, which has become widely known as political rival Kamala Harris' unofficial campaign song, to be used by the Trump campaign, forcing the Lemonade singer to take action against the 13-second clip. It is understood that the clip was still available on Trump campaign spokesperson Stephen Chung's social media account until Wednesday, despite her record label having issued a cease and desist notice. It has since been removed. The incident came after the Harris Walls campaign debuted a new ad soundtrack using the song Freedom with actor Jeffrey Wright providing the narration on Monday. In a voiceover, he asks, what kind of America do we want? Read more. Family of Isaac Hayes to sue Donald Trump as ex-president keeps using his hit songs. One where we're divided, angry, depressed. Come on. We're Americans. Fascism. We conquered it. The moon. Landed on it. The future. Building it. Freedom. Nobody loves it more. Democratic candidate Kamala Harris has been using the track, with the full permission of Beyoncé ever since her campaign began earlier this summer, following Joe Biden's decision to step down from running a second term. During her first public engagement, after securing the president's support, Kamala's even walked out to the podium while the song played, with a subsequent video release also heavily featuring the tune shortly after. Should Beyoncé take legal action against Trump? Vote in our poll here to have your say. Donald Trump, meanwhile, is no stranger to using music without the permission of artists at his rallies, with the Republican having received a string of legal threats and cease and desist notices from a number of artists over the years, including Celine Dion, Sinead O'Connor, Village People, Neil Young, The Rolling Stones, Phil Collins, Steven Tyler and Rihanna to name just a few.